guys. Hello. We are going to have some dinner tonight. We're going to go to um, Chubby Kettle. For hot pot. Chubby Kettle. Mm -hmm. we'll, um, we'll see how fat and chubby these uh, beefs are, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> it looks good on the uh, picture. Yep, the review looks good and uh, mm -hmm. the picture looks good. So we'll go in there and uh, see if it's really that good. Just really dark oh. outside. Uh, individual pot plate. Okay, just give me one moment. Thank, Thank you. you. Oh, honey, they got mm -hmm. the thing. Yeah. Hey, I like that. They got a revolving uh, kind of restaurant kind of stuff. And then you get your sauces there. Oh, and then the other thing. Just a little kitchen in here. Thank you. Thank you. Look at this, the food is coming by. <laughs> this is interesting. So I guess you just grab whatever you like to eat and uh, yeah. or you can order it if they don't have it, right? Yeah. Oh, pretty cool. It's like um, revolving restaurant sushi. So you grab something from the gray plate, it's going to be 99 cents. And then you got the blue plate, 199. Black play two ninety nine and That's gold the, play three ninety nine. Yeah, the white one actually is a ninety nine. That's like the gray one, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, let's check out this one. Premium combo served two people, not only ninety nine dollars. Oh, original oxtail. The two 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 soup, two meat. Would you like that? Yeah. Looks that looks like pretty that. good. Yeah, so, actually, yeah. Combo? Yes. Yeah, and then we can get more stuff yep. over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if we want it. So, then. what kind of meat, uh, what kind of bread guys want it? I'm going to try the oxtail tomato. Should I do just the house special? What is that in there? Uh, it's a pong soup. We're using the chicken, beef, and the pork. Try it. Yeah, I'll try it. So okay. What about other meat? You guys like it? Two more? Yeah, we'll take um, the beef brisket and the, and the pork belly, I guess. Yeah. All right, let's check out the sauce bar here. So they got uh, a little bit of cilantro, green onion, soy sauce, garlic. Looks like all the sauces here. Yeah, quite a bit. And yeah. more onion. Okay. My sauce is really plain, you know. It's just uh, garlic, green onion, and cilantro, and soy sauce. That's it. Not What's me. yours? <laughs> I mix a lot of things in it. Um, I got cilantro, garlic, mushroom sauce, hoisin sauce. Uh, some satay sauce, <laughs> a lot of things. Well, it looks like some of the food is here, some the tofu combo. You got the soft tofu and then you got some, um, that's bean curd they call it, and then, um, I don't know what kind of tofu that is. It looks yummy though. Got your mushroom pot. Okay, let's eat. My bit's so, so thick. Great. Thank you. Thank you. So I got the tomato and oxtail broth. Do you see an oxtail in here? No oxtail in here. It's just a soup. It smells amazing though. What did you get? You got their house uh, special, right? Yeah. Basically, I think it's chicken, pork, and beef. beef. Like slow simmer together, boil together. Oh, perfect. Here's the egg yolk for it. You guys can either dip in the egg yolk before cooking it, or just okay. pour the egg yolk right on top. Great. And then after your soup is boiled, just cook it five to eight seconds. Perfect. So this is the A5 ragu, and then uh, we got some eggs to go along with it. We'll pour that on top thereafter when we're ready to eat that. My sauce is a bit too thick today. I'm gonna go get more in here. Okay, we got some uh, invitation crab, I think. See, a little bit of uh, fish, mussels, and two shrimps. Oh wow! Thank you. Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> yes. The food comes fast and furious. Here's a little bit of a uh, beef brisket here. Also looks very good, you know. You can tell the marbling is not as nice as the A5 ragu. That's the difference right there, you know. You see the marbling inside the meat on that one? But it's time to get that little bit. That's that tofu thing. Is it? <laughs> oh, 
always call him that. I just reached in there and grabbed, the, grabbed an order of this. These things are so good. They're deep fried bean curd, and you just dunk them in there for like. A second for me. It's so quick. Depends. Depends on what you want. You know, if you're if you want it got a little bit crunchy, you just dunk it in there for a, for a second or two, and it'll soak up the broth. If you want it soggier, then you just dunk it in there a little bit longer, right? So I just like two seconds. Me too. <laughs> I like crunchy. Oh, good. Oh, perfect. But I do like it like that. You know what? You just get what you want. Yeah. It's not all you can eat. Nope. <gasps> Yeah, don't worry, you can have, we'll grab another <laughs> bowl, okay? Calm down. <laughs> I I don't like it. My sister She's is still eyeing my food. <sighs> no. So the drinks come with this, right? So we get like a cocktail or pop. I cannot tell, but I know it's got lemon and strawberry. Really good actually. Let's put this guy in there first. La 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 la. Quick, quick, quick. Take it out. Put it into the sauce. Looking good. I'm gonna eat all the food before your thing boil. Yeah. It's, it's you sure you got it on max? Yeah. No, my stack boiling. Put some mushrooms in there. Love the mushroom. I find that this broth is so flavorful, I don't even need to dip too much into the sauce at all. Got a lot of uh, tomato mm -hmm. taste it. You don't like tomato though. Not so much. I'm gonna try the beef with no sauce on it, just the soup. Flavor. Mm. Yeah, it's great just like that actually. Normally I always dip it into the sauce. Yeah. I don't think I need it today. Let me try yours. You sound sad about your soup. Because you you sound so good with your soup. <laughs> <laughs> you sound so sad with your choice. How come? And it's so slow. It's good. What do you think? Mm -hmm. I like it. Mm -hmm. Some of our friends say, you know, I when I go to eat, I want to just sit down and eat. I don't want to have to cook my own food. But you know, that's the fun of it. You can order whatever you want to. Eat and it's really easy to cook. You just kind of dunk it in. Usually, some meats are like 10 seconds, and sometimes you get some beef balls and stuff like that. You just cook those a little bit longer, like a few minutes and stuff like that. But the good thing about hot, hot and tofu is that the dough, the tofu just soaks up all this good stuff, and you just put it in your mouth. Yeah. Some uh, pork belly here. Oh, pork belly, go for yeah. it. Pork belly, always good. <laughs> always cannot go wrong. Well. How's the pork belly? Really fatty and yummy and sweet. <laughs> really. These easy. pork belly, they slice them to be so thin. This is like four pieces on here. I couldn't even grab them one at a time, so. Just drop them in, you know, the thinner they are, the quicker they cook, right? So. That's a good thing. All right, some pork belly. You like it? Mm hmm I do. How do they slice it so thin, huh? Just like with beef, right? Yeah. Let's try some rice that they take. Ooh, look at the burn oh. one. The rice came back. Yeah. So he mixed it up in the background there and then um, served a two bowl for us here. Okay, let's get some. Oh, I can smell the burnt rice a little bit. Oh, that's perfect. That's the bottom of the bowl because the bowl is so hot when they put the rice in. Cheers. I 
taste a lot of burnt flavor on mine. I love it. Yeah. I love it. This the crunchy of it too? Yeah, the rice a little bit crunchy. Yeah. But that's all I taste though. I couldn't taste anything else. The beef, right? Taste a little bit of beef. Mm -hmm. I don't think you can taste the I still the don't taste the foie gras. Yeah, no. But definitely a lot of burnt flavor on it. It's very good though. I like it. <laughs> oh, the fish. I forgot I put some fish in. Don't you think we should try the main event? Mm -hmm. All right, let's check out this guy here. I guess you pour the egg in. Oh yeah. So the egg will coat the um, the A5 ragu, and then you put it in. This is just for decoration. We'll get rid of that. So they said to make it softer, the egg make it even softer, right? I never tried it this way before. Mm -hmm. You know, we always have beef, but I never put eggs on it and then cook the beef, so we'll see. Pass it out. One piece there. Ready. Oh, you just need it for a few seconds. Yeah. I think I chewed three times and it just melted after that. Good. You got a little bit of egg taste in there. It's good. No, you don't like it? I know. I like the sweetness of the beef by itself. Let me try less egg. Oh, that's the good stuff. One piece. So thin you can't even taste anything. <laughs> it melts so quickly. It just melted, right? Yeah. Let's try two pieces together. Two pieces together. So good. I'm gonna get more vegetable in there for my vegetable intake. At first I plan to get some noodles. Not anymore now. <laughs> At first I thought I was gonna need some noodle too. I might still need some anyway, because you know you cannot let this broth that's go right. to waste. You know, yeah. you gotta put some noodles in it and eat it. Noodles and hot pot, that's like always at the end because you got, you cooked all these good food in it, like seafood, beef, pork, whatever. So all the flavor went into the soup. So now you put some noodles into it and have the noodle. It's like, perfect. It's like heaven. That's what I want to say. <laughs> I found some oxtail in my soup. Oh, it just fell right, just fell right apart. Really gelatinous. I'm sure it's very good too. How is that? Soft and smooth. Daddy? Let's try a little piece here. Oh yeah. Daddy, right? But you know, it's good because it's in tomatoes. Actually make it really nice. You know that golden plate? with the beef ball never came back. <laughs> I should have grabbed it earlier. Muscle is a really good size here. Queen muscle. You don't want one? Honey. I'll cook it for you. So the shrimp is not peeled, it's in a little skewer here. Just drop it in. My a little bit of work on the shrimp. Oh yeah, I took up the shrimp here. Honey, gonna work it? Oh, send it over this way. You send it over this way so I can process it? Am I a processing plant? Thank you, sir. You're welcome. Try the shrimp. Peeled. <laughs> On the stick. Mm. Perfectly cooked. There's my oxtail. There's the bone for my oxtail. <laughs> found him. <laughs> you found him. Wait, someone took those beef balls for sure. Gonna have to order it. <laughs> honey, eat. My honey is so quickly. I say, honey, eat. Honey, like, okay. Done. <laughs> Don't need to. Let me take care of that for you. Oh, no, honey, eat. No questions asked. <laughs>
You don't have to ask me twice to eat A5 Wagyu. I'm being honest. I, I need it a bit thicker, hot. Then you'll be like, oh, it's too fatty, it's too much. You know, I want to taste that fatty sweetness of it. This is too thin. I can't even taste anything. I'm gonna let this vegetable rest a little bit this time. Just all the oil on there, oh my god. Almost died eating that. <laughs> Anybody died eating hot pot before you think? What do you guys think? <laughs> Ate something too hot? Burn inside out. Yeah. Look at all these fancy vegetables in there boiling, you know? Sometimes I like vegetable more than, uh, than beef sometimes, you know? Um, oh yeah, no, you can take that. Oh, actually, no, there's a little bit more in there. I love vegetable. Perfect. And um, I saw some um, a yellow plate um, beef balls. Beef balls? The Italian beef balls? I think so, yeah. You Looks really good. If you can get me one plate of that, please. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Is this still eyeing you? What's that? The pork belly. Let's put it away. You really think I'm a garbage can, huh? No, it's good for you. I don't know, let me know if uh, your wife or your girlfriend uh, treats you like you're a garbage can also and make you eat all the leftovers. Comment down below. Okay, check out these beef balls. They got, um, they got like tendon inside. So that's going to add a lot of texture to it. So it's going to be really bouncy and crunchy. Can't wait to try this uh, beef ball here. Look at these guys here. These guys are like right there. They got really good tendon in it. So, you want you want me to cook you one? Yeah, half, half. Half? half. half. There's no half here. You either one or. Then you bite half and give me half. <laughs> Have your pork belly, honey. And don't talk about the pork belly. And just so you know, you're not a garbage can, okay? I gave you the best beef earlier. Now I give you the best bacon. I'm eating my vegetable. Overcooked veggie. Okay. Here we go. Cook. Time for some beef tendon ball. Beef balls are, I think, cooked already anyway. They really boiled it already. You're just warming it up basically. Depends on the kind. Cheers. Depends on the kind, yes. Some beef ball are not cooked. Look at all the tendons just sticking out of there. Like all of them. All over the place. Mm. Tim doesn't like beef ball normally. He never eat beef ball in the in the soup. Yeah, beef ball is the last thing I want to eat, but not this beef ball, okay? This one actually, as expected, got the tendon on it, so it got really good texture on it. It's got some crunchy flavor to it. Did you steal my broth? My better. Yours better? Mm -hmm. So you're saying your broth just turned better than mine? Yeah. But I don't know. No way, okay? Yeah. I don't Let's know. Is that too hot? Oh yeah, it's so hot. Okay. Way better. Okay, it's very sweet. It's really it sweet. Has some ginger taste to it too. Yeah. Yeah. And a little bit of herbal because they do have some herbal stuff in it. A little bit of um is it goji berry or what's yeah. in there? Yeah, and then uh, sweet apple. Yeah, oh yeah. A little bit of Chinese herb in it, so yeah, it, it did get better. You know what? I wouldn't mind some noodle. Is that noodle? That's noodle, right? Yeah. That's noodle too. So convenient, you just go in there, reach in there, and grab whatever you like. And I found some noodles. Oh, oh look at that noodle. Okay, I got all the noodles in, got some soup in, got my beef ball in. Check out that bowl of noodle right there. The beef ball just sunk in there. 
a little bit. I don't think you guys need me to try this anyway. You know what it's gonna taste like. It's gonna taste awesome. Noodle soup. Steaming hot. Very good. The noodle is like al dente, so it's perfect. It's actually not the broth. And the broth? You gotta have a you gotta have a small. No, thank you. Yeah, no, you gotta but, have you gotta have. Some. But this one is not the potato. No, noodle. it's not. It's yeah. rice noodle. Yeah. Mm. Right. Mm. Even your full, it's good. Mm. You are right. Mm. Oh, the noodle is perfect. Mm -hmm. And actually, the soup like it, it's, it's not fatty because of the, the tomato. It's fatty, but not fatty. But the tomato, like, just balance itself. It's yeah. just nice. You know what? Tomato and oxtail, that's a great combination. So the combo comes with a dessert. Ice cream bar. Melon. Looks like a melon, yeah? yeah. Cheers. Yeah. The bill came to $114.86. That was very affordable and good food. So what did you think of our chubby cattle? It's pretty good. I like it. Um, for the price in US here, it's a decent price for good food. So, oh, for sure, yeah. yeah. Like, um, I think, like I said, the bill was $120 before, before tax. I mean, before tips. Yeah. Um, that's really good for you get the taste of uh, A5 ragu. So. The combo we have is $99. That includes two soup, two meat, uh, veggie, and beef, and some seafood. Lots of food. You yeah, know, a lot lots of, of food. food. Yeah. We, more than enough. Yeah. More than enough food. So. Yeah. And uh, drink as well. You can actually drink cocktail. So. Yes. Nice. So yeah, no, we would recommend it. It's a very good place to eat. So definitely check it out if you're in Vegas. Once again, it's off the strip. So <laughs> we're featuring a lot of restaurants off the strip this time around because um, we find that there's more value in um, eating off the strip. It's quite expensive to eat on the strip inside a casino when you can okay. find much yeah. cheaper food out here and they're just as good, you know. they. The quality is just as good, and um, because really they order from the same supplier, all the food comes from the same place anyway. So, we'll see you guys next time here in Vegas again, okay? Hopefully, take care, guys. Take care. Bye bye. Good night.